and welcome back to another Lippies of the Week video. This is for November 1st through the 7th, so it makes it easy for me. Uh, I don't have as much progress on the last week's stuff as I would have liked to have had, mostly because I was working a lot and I wasn't sure the logistics of how to wear lip balm behind a mask. I feel like I've seen over and over you're not supposed to do that. So they haven't as see they haven't seen as heavy of usage as they normally would, so I'm not sure if I should like start turning this into like a bi-weekly thing. I don't know. I don't know. But um anyway, our Burt's Bees salted caramel. We got it down to here. So I mean that one has a nice little dent in it. We did something to that one. The chapstick mint mocha. Oh, uh, we got that a bit in that one too, actually. Not terrible. Not as good as I would have preferred, but not terrible. Our Little Moon Essentials Peppermint Shtick Frosty Lip Balm. This one is still, like, at the frickin' top. of <laughs> Shameful, because I love that one. <laughs> so that one, I have to remind myself, goes back in the skincare fridge. And then this guy... It's hard to really say. The Bath & Body Works Twisted Peppermint Lip Gloss. Um, like, they're like the tiniest, tiniest little divot I feel right here, but that's like it for progress on that one. So my choices for the upcoming week, even though we're a day into it, uh, we are bringing back this guy again. I am so hell-bent to use this one up all the way, you don't even know. I just, I don't know why I have such a boner for, I want to use this up all the way, but it's the Eos Sugar Plum. I know I have the stick of it too, but shh. <laughs> And, like, the Canadian maple is exactly the same thing, but shh. Um, this one, you know, starting point, it is way down. I think this is why I keep coming back to this one, because this one feels possible to use up, whereas the others are, like, full. <laughs> so we've got that. We have got our brand new Tint Cosmetics uh, Rollerball Lip Potion, which is, like, full still, because I've only used it, like, twice so far. So we've got that one, because I just opened that on Halloween. Today's the second. We have the Blistex Lip Infusions Hydrate Quenching, uh, which pretty much at the top, because I just reviewed that, like, a day or two ago. And then the Eco Lips Citrus Got Real. I keep wanting to say shit just got real. Um, it's got a teeny tiny bit at the top, and it ain't much, but, uh, we will see what we can do, but ooh, that Eos, I'm just like, man, I want to use it up so effing badly, you don't even know, it like frustrates me how badly I want to see this one get used all the way up, and I don't know, I think it's just because it's so far down that I'm like, come on, come on, man, you can do it, go for it, before it spoils, fucking use it up, so... I'm bringing it back again. I know, this one is like a frequent one in the lists because I'm trying so hard to get this one used all the way up. When it happens, which one's gonna like become the next in line that I'm like so just gung-ho about? Use it up, use it up, use it up! I don't even know. I don't even know. But yeah, these are my picks for this week. And we'll see how I do with that. <laughs> Not much to say here. So anyways, that's it for this one. So as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything I want. It's all down below. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, until next time, bye-bye.